Today I'm going to be showing you how to do toggles in 2019 Unity or well the way I know how to do it. So first of all what you're going to do is you want to have selected the thing that you want to toggle. In my case I'm going to have I'm going to do the body harness. Next you want to select your avatar and on the right side on the controller click the little circle next to it and you want to find the FBX controller of your avatar. In my case it's the first one. After that you're going to you're going to go to your animator, click the little plus sign, scroll down and name of the thing that you want to have it toggled. Um and note here you need to uh, remember the name of the thing that you're toggling because it needs to be named everywhere else. Click the little gear on it, click wait then go to your parameters we're gonna do the same thing click on all plus and then right here you want to click on bool you can do the int as well but in this case i'm doing the bool scroll down and you're going to name it the same as you name it in your layers next you're going to right click on the window next to it create and then empty and then do this again position it how you want to Next, you want, you want to click on the first one, make transition and make transition back. You basically right click and then you make transition in between them. Click on this little arrow and on the right side, click plus here. Now where it says VR emotes, you just want to click it and you want to find the thing that you named and the thing next to it. Uh, I'll, I'd leave it the same as it is. I don't want to touch it and just do the other thing do the same on the other but in this case make it disable now have exit time has exit time you don't need to do this but if you want to you can next you're going to go back on your assets in the empty space you want to go create and then animation click on it and you want to basically name it uh, how you want to, but in this case, I'm just going to use the name, the same name everywhere. Click on it and make sure that the loop time is on. Next, you want to go up all the way at the top, we'll go window, go animation. And now you can drag this little window. I'm going to drag it next to my animator because it's much more easy to work with. You want to click on your avatar on the right, on the left. And now, as you can see, we see a bunch of little cool windows here. You want to go back on your animator and click on the second window that we selected and up at the top right here where it says motion you want to select it and then find the thing that the of the thing that you want to turn on once you got that done you want to go back on the animator as where it says happy here you just want to find the thing it might say something different for you but it, the location is the same so you just click on there and just make uh, select the thing that you what you're using now you want to click add pr priority and now in this case if it's uh, your glasses on your head you want to go armature and open your avatar all the way until you see head uh, set glasses but in my case it's just at the bottom here so i'm just gonna select it it may not be at the bottom for you you'd have to maybe go dig for it but once you find it you click is active and then plus now you want to select the one second, which is just click next to it and you should be selected and you just drag the thing all the way to the uh, that is on the right to the left. You want to go down at the search bar and just type in sub and just go sub toggle. Once you got that done, you want to add a controller and then name it the same that we for, for it's everywhere and you want to name it the same. And you can also add a small little texture in the menu if you want to be fancy about it. Also make sure that the type is toggle. Click on your avatar again and go find the parameters. If you go now click on add and now name it the same again, the same name where we use everywhere. And you want to click on bool. Go to your sub toggle again. Extend the thing that you're working on. You want to go parameter and then where it says none, you want to find your thing. In my case, the body harness. Next, click on your avatar, go animator. 
and now where it says happy there select the you should see your glasses and now as you can see we have an animation on and off Before uploading your avatar, make sure that you have selected the thing on the in the hierarchy and just hide it on the right. And if it's hidden on your avatar by default, you just good to go. Fix anything if there's something to fix and you're good to upload. And now as you can see in the game, in my menu, it works. But anyway, I hope that this video helped and I really hope that you can do some cool things. Now I'm going to go turn off my PC because I'm tired of Unity. Yeah, yeet.